It was the moment everyone was waiting for around the world and in Toledo. As the new leader for the Catholic Church debuted, eyes were glued to TV screens. I was kind of nervous. Bishop Leonard Blair of the Diocese of Toledo describes how many feel about the moments leading up to the moment when Pope Francis I debuted. He becomes the first papal leader from Latin America, a break in tradition for a church known for its tradition. The Americas have come of age uh, in, in, the, in the life of the Universal Church, and uh, so this represents um, a, a new perspective. Um, obviously, we're all one in the basic faith of the Catholic Church, but we also bring our particular culture and background. Wanting to reach out continually to the poor and modeling that in his life. A life that Cardinal Jorge Bogoglia has practiced for most of his life. The 76-year-old Jesuit has been a priest since 1969 and has held a variety of leadership roles, most recently as Archbishop of Buenos Aires, Argentina. And more than ever in our church today, we need to continue that spirit of reconciliation and call. He, the Pope illustrated today that he's very humble. Before he blessed, he asked for a blessing. There are many storms, many trials, there's all kinds of things, and we pray that the, the Pope will, uh, will have this, the grace and strength to fulfill his ministry.